Alright, so this is my review on the Young Now 35mm lens. It's a 2.0 f-stop, so it allows you to get a lot of light and low light situations. It's a pretty dope lens. It got some pros, it got some cons, and we'll break that down now. Alright, for me the pro of this lens is that it's a cheap lens. I got it for $88, and you could probably get one for around that price, but no more than $100 for this lens. And if you like me, I do a lot of running and gunning. So one of these lenses is pretty good for what it is that I do just in case I ding up a lens and it's not one of my L series or center lens and stuff like that. This right here, I could rough it up, break it if I feel like it, and it's only $88. It doesn't take much to replace. So I love that about this lens. Another thing that I like about this lens is that it's super sharp. If you hit them focus points the way you're supposed to hit those focus points, then you're gonna get a nice quality image, especially if you're using video. If you're using it for photography, you're gonna get your nice shallow depth of field, your nice bokeh, especially if you're shooting on a full frame sensor, you're gonna get some nice images out of this. I've shot with lens that costs way more and it doesn't give me that quality image that I feel confident with. This does and it's only $88. It also has autofocus, manual focus, Focus. And if you went to video, you want to do more manual focus, or even photography, you're doing manual focus. But if you're up and coming and you really don't know what it is, boom, you can hit that button and it's auto focus. You're gonna love that. All right, so the con about this lens is being that it's $88, super plastic. It's not like Fisher Price plastic, but it's like a uh, quality, high grade toy plastic. So you can drop this and break this thing easily. I mean, $88, what more can you expect? But be careful. Another thing that I don't like about this lens is that the focus range it has no travel at all. I'm going. As you can see, I'm going from one end to the other end, and it's not really taking me much to get there. And if you got big hands and big fingers like me, you're gonna miss those focus points. So it takes a lot of practice to get those focus points down pat know exactly what it is that you're trying to hit and using this finger ring because you can pretty much miss it sometimes. It's not thick like those L series or cinema lenses. So practice makes perfect. You have to do a lot more practice with this lens than any other lens, but you'll get some good quality images out of it. Alright, so that's it for my lens review on the Young Now 35mm lens. Go out and get you one. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. Like. Comment. Do all of that good stuff on the channel, and I'll be back Monday for another video.